Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you how you can make your own common craft style videos or explainer style videos by using Google Slides and Screencastify. So here's how we're going to do it. I'm going to create my story in Google Slides and my story is called Life with Toddlers, a Keep Your Sanity production. Then I have a couple of slides in here. Now you can build in as many slides as you want for the sake of brevity. I'm going to keep this one to just a couple of slides. And you can see I've already written in the beginning of my story. This is Richard. Richard loves being a dad. This is Richard's daughter. She's a toddler. So I'm going to start here with dragging in a picture of Richard. Now this cutout is a cutout that I got from Common Craft. They offer uh, more than 3,000 cut out pictures like this that you can purchase and download. You can also find similar cutouts to, like this on sites like pixabay.com or Unsplash Photos. You'll find lots of them like it. Or of course you can always draw your own and upload them to your Google Slides. Now I'm going to put in a picture to represent my toddler. Now again I need to resize that. There we go. So let's make the dad bigger and the toddler smaller. Now I want to add a little bit more so I'm going to put in a little text box and the text box is just going to say this is Richard and I'll even put a border around it to make it stand out. There we go. And of course you can play with all the colors and your font sizes if you want to use a different color font. There you go. Make it bigger. There we go. And over here we can do the same thing and put in a text box. Put in a daughter. Right. And now highlight that. All right, now I'm going to do this next slide. And on this slide, we'll do the next part of the story. His daughter was learning to use the bathroom. So we'll put in the picture of the daughter again, the baby again. Make her a little smaller there. And to represent the bathroom, we'll use this toilet picture. Okay, put that in place. And then to complete the story of it was not going well, she kept saying no. Richard didn't know what to do. We'll put in this picture of someone looking a little bit frustrated or throwing up your hands. All right. Now, I'm going to go back and add animation to each part of this story. So to do that, let's start by selecting the person here. And that's the piece we're going to animate. Okay. So let's go to Transitions. Select that. We're going to animate. We'll have it fade in on click. Now we'll do our next thing, and we'll animate that one to fade in on click. We'll do the same over here, fade in on click. And we'll do the same thing here, fade in on click. If we want to see how that plays back now, we can check it out by just clicking. And there we go. Now we'll do the same thing over here. So we'll just simply say add animation and we'll say fade in on click. And we can do the same thing over here. Click there. Add animation, fade in on click. And over here, add an animation, fade in on click. And again, to play that back, we just simply click and go through that way. All right, so now the next part of this is where we bring in screen castify. I'm going to go back up to the beginning of my story and we'll use screen castify to now capture the playback of the story and we'll select browser tab and we'll hit the record button mm. And so now Screencastify is recording 
just this tab and I can do the voiceover for my story, Life with Toddlers, a Keep Your Sanity production. This is Richard. Richard loves being a dad. This is Richard's daughter. His daughter was learning to use the potty, but it wasn't going so well. Richard didn't know what to do. And then I can go up here and stop the recording. And so now screen by the recording. And you can see here, I can now play back this production. It copied just that tab. Didn't capture any of the surrounding material on my desktop like Screencast-O-Matic is doing right at this moment. And of course, when it's done, if I'm happy with it, I can go ahead and save it to my Google Drive. So that's how you can create your own Common Craft style video or Explainer style video by using Google Slides and Screencastify. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetech4teachers.com and practicaledtech.com.